Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about The Flash, Supergirl, and the rest of the DC TV shows because we got some big news as in regards to when our shows are ending and when they are starting. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so we've got some new information, and this is all officially confirmed. This is written down in documents. I've read the documents that, you know, they have to submit when you're going to film in a certain city, in this case for the CW and the DC TV shows. It's Vancouver. So there is a form and there is an official document stating everything that I'm going to tell you guys in this video. So we've got official confirmation of the start and end dates for our DC TV shows. So yeah. Let's go ahead and get right into it, but first off I want to say sorry if there's any background noise, there's works going on where I currently am, and so I that can't be helped, I'm sorry about that. But anyway, so let's go on to the big things, and this is our DC TV shows. We're going to be talking about Legends of Tomorrow first, because I think Legends right now is a bit up in the air, because we didn't know when they were going to return to filming, we were like, oh, they're going to wait till like nearer the end of the year, like December time or something like that. Because, you know, we heard literally nothing about Legends, but no, we've got official confirmation that Legends of Tomorrow Season 6, which is crazy how we had Season 6 already, I remember when it started. Anyway, so, official starting date for Legends Season 6 is October 5th, 2020, and the official ending date is May 10th, 2021. So, that is a pretty long time, that is actually a longer shooting run than Supergirl is going to be doing this year. I have some predictions as in regards to what, you know, how many episodes Legends might have. I'm going to guess it's about like 15, 16 episodes, you know, because they do have a higher budget, but then there's also a lot of special effects and everything. And even though this would potentially be, you know, enough time to do like you know, the same episode count as The Flash or Batwoman, like, like, 20 plus episodes, because they've always stuck to the shorter episode count, and even though it could be, I still think they're gonna go for a shorter amount, maybe they'll have some bigger breaks in between filming. Yeah, that's some big news as in regards to Legends. Now let's move over to Superman and Lois, Season 1, and by the way, we're gonna get to Supergirl and The Flash towards the end of the video, but Superman and Lois Season 1, obviously, they haven't started production yet, and so this is executive produced by Sarah Schechter, Todd Helbing, who is the creator of the show, and obviously Greg Berlanti and everyone. But the official start date for Superman and Lois is currently October 13th, 2020, and it's set to be stopping production May 1st, 2021. So again, this would signal a at least 18 to 20 episode count. I'm guessing that you're probably gonna go similar to Legends, Maybe they'll go 16, maybe they'll go less. Like I said with Legends, this is around the same time period like that they've got to shoot. So I guess it could be the same as Legends, like 15, 16 episodes. But also they could extend it to 18. I think there was some news on this recently. You guys can correct me in the comments below. I know lots of you guys are up to date. I just kind of forgot how many episodes they were actually aiming for. But at the back of my mind, I've got the number 18 in my head, which could be wrong, could be right, but... Yeah, so October 13th start and May 1st finish. Okay, so let's move over to Batwoman Season 2. And again, we can't do Black Lightning because that doesn't shoot in Vancouver. I'm going off of Vancouver starting dates and ending dates right here. So Batwoman Season 2 has officially started production. It started two days ago. You guys may have seen some social media posts by some of the cast of Batwoman and everything like that. So they're officially back and they started September 3rd and they are going to be finishing production on season two, May 10th, 2021. So again, this is a whole month longer than what Legends and Superman Lois are gonna be getting because they started so early. And I'm guessing this definitely confirms they're going for a 20 plus episode count for Batwoman season two, because they were going for that already with season one and obviously it got cut a bit short due to the pandemic and everything like that. But yeah, so they've got a whole extra month, that means at least, you know, a few more episodes. I'm guessing they're going to have 20 to 21 episodes. Obviously, this is all tentative, like they've actually started production, but I mean like the ending dates 
could change depending on the situation in Vancouver at the time. So yeah, as of right now, they've started production, they are filming currently. Not sure if they're going to do much public filming, so I don't know how much you guys will see. However, most of the stuff we'll see is probably from the actors and the people behind the shows, you know, sharing some behind the scenes stuff for now. Okay, so let's move over to talk about The Flash Season 7. So this is going to be returning very, very soon. Their office actually opens September 18th, so that's not very long away. And uh, that means, you know, people are going to be back in the production office and everything like that. But the official start date for filming is the 1st of October until May 19th, 2021. So a bit longer, but still not as much as Batwoman. However, I do think The Flash, because they've got one episode in the bag already, like they just need to shoot like a few scenes, that's it. So I think this is definitely meaning The Flash is going for a 20 episode count, because they do have a slight advantage over Batwoman in that they filmed basically a whole episode and they can probably use some of the extra clips in like episode 2 and stuff and they know what they're doing like they've had these plans for such a long time because they were going to film them already they probably have all the setups and they have everything literally according to plan so I'm saying The Flash is going to be getting its normal 20 to 21 episodes this season that's obviously as of right now things could change due to the virus and everything but right now yeah, The Flash is probably going to have 20 to 21 episodes, and so it starts October 1st, so it's currently September 5th. The actors are back, well not all of them, but they're slowly starting to get back. Some people are already in their quarantine from The Flash cast, but then, you know, some people will come in the next week or so, but they'll all be back for October 1st, and so they'll film up till May 19th, 2021. Now let's move on to the big thing I wanted to talk about this episode, because we were kind of unsure as well, like Legends, we were kind of unsure what was going to happen with Supergirl this season due to their starting date and, you know, the fact that Melissa is going to have a kid and she's probably going to not be there at the start. So we were all kind of curious, like, what's going to be happening? Like, we don't have a problem that Supergirl is not coming out in January. It's coming out spring slash summertime. That has been confirmed. And so it's interesting to see the official dates. And what we've got from these official dates is that Supergirl is starting September 28th, so yeah, that's been confirmed, what Jesse Raff said recently. And then we have a official ending date for Supergirl Season 6 as being April 5th, 2021. So that is pretty damn early, right? Because when you think about it, I said most of the shows finish around May time, that's a whole month before. So I'm guessing Supergirl is not going to have its normal 20 plus episode count. I think if you do the maths and you think about it, it's a possibility that they may be doing 18 to 19 episodes for season 6. However, there is a chance that they may cut it down to like 16 episodes because of the fact that they don't have that much time. You know, they're starting at the end of September, I guess they get a benefit of a few days before October starts. However, you got breaks and everything and you know Christmas There is a decent amount of break that they normally go on during Christmas So then if they're only filming to April I don't see them doing a 20 episode plus season and also due to the fact that Melissa may not be there at the start of the season for like the first few weeks or something I reckon she's gonna come back sometime mid-October unless we're completely wrong about this and we got the timetable completely wrong it seems like there is going to be some sort of trouble in the scheduling and I don't think they're going to make a 20 plus episode count but there is a possibility they could make 18, 19 maybe, I would say 18 is probably more likely. But yeah, so what do you guys think about all of this? Are you excited for the new seasons of our shows? It's great to get official confirmation that they are trying to film for such a long time. Because really, when you think of it, we all thought all, of, all the seasons are going to be really cut short. But it seems like at least Batwoman and The Flash are going for 20 plus episodes. Supergirl may be cut down this season, it's very likely. And then it's good to see that we got confirmation on Legends. And we got confirmation on, you know, everything basically. Like Superman and Lois. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, if you did enjoy it, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and share the video around on social media, tag me at the DC TV show, it really does help out the channel, so I'll catch you guys later, goodbye.
icy road.